Well, hello everybody and welcome back to another video discussion. Today I will be discussing a painting I did of Kota, my parents' dog. The title of this painting is Kota, but there is an alternative title, Dog by Tree. Kota is a European Golden Retriever which is a lot lighter colored and more stocky, uh, stockier built than the uh, American Golden Retriever that you're more familiar with. My parents got her back around 2012, 2011 or 2012, and prior to then, I didn't even know such a breed existed. She looks kind of like a yellow lab, too, but she has much more fur on her than a yellow lab does. But I did this painting of her based on a photo I took of her when I was in the state of uh, South Dakota visiting family. But I decided to do this winter scene of her, and it's very appropriate for this time of year, December, Basically, it looks like it's towards the end of the day, when, maybe around 3 o'clock or 3.30 in the afternoon when the, it's getting close to sunsetting, as the days are much shorter in the winter time. But right here, I have a good use of texture, impasto, which is when you have textured paint on the canvas. And do you all know that artist Van Gogh used a lot of texture in his pieces, as well as many other painters? Um, I think it just adds good detail to it and some good uh, expression to it. But right here, you know, I use a lot of light and shading which provides good emotion for the piece. And right here you just see Coda just staring out into the distance. We don't know what she's looking at. She could be looking at the tree, but more likely she's looking at something beyond what we can see in the painting. As a dog, she tends to live more in the present moment, which is something we should all learn to do. So she's just probably taking in everything, enjoying the atmosphere, the winter, fresh winter air, and of course with her long fur coat she stays pretty warm in it. You'll notice that the good composition and all of the trees and the depth over here in the horizon, you see a few, all over here is a field, and you see some trees way off in the distance. Creates a sense of depth in the painting, in a two-dimensional painting. You could, you feel like you could easily walk into this painting and walk all the way over there. And... You'll notice that my signature is right here under the, on the rock. So there's my last name, plus this looks like the year it was painted, 2020. During the COVID pandemic. Um, anyway, the um, combination of all, of six colors that I use in my painting creates a good, colorful composition in this piece. The usage of titanium white, French ultramarine blue, cadmium red hue, burnt umber, viridian green, and cadmium yellow all come together. Although I'm not sure if I actually used any green in this painting. But these rocks are not actually gray. They're actually a mixture of burnt umber and French ultramarine blue. As with the trees, you have different shades coming in with 
mixture of blue or yellow and a little bit of red in there, as well as white. Kota recently had died of a brain tumor in, I believe, August of this year, 2022. So she had to be put down at the vets. This, pe this original piece I gave to my parents as a wedding anniversary present, had it framed and gave it to them as an anniversary gift. Even though the original piece now belongs to them, you can still order prints of this piece as well as uh, merchandise such as mugs or magnets from my website with this image printed on them. Just go to my website listed in the link below. Thanks and have a fantastic day.